Hello everyone, this is Rare Puncture with F1 2014. As you can see, we have a new aero package that we'll be using for Singapore, which is race number 14 of season number two. And we're going to qualifying one. But first, we'll take a look at our setup, as always. Here's our alignment engine our suspension, the balance, 1 4, 4951 high pressure with 11 11 wings. And here we go with qualifying one. And we made it out of qualifying one easily. We just used the, uh, we just did one lap on the prime tire, so we have. Plenty of option tires to use. So we'll go to qualifying two. And here's qualifying two. Great job. We're through to the shootout. And we make it into qualifying three pretty easily. Although we're we definitely don't have the pace as the uh, Mercedes it looks like. So here we go with qualifying three. We'll see if we can put in a better lap this time. And here we go. Going to the first corner. Doing it all right. Oh, pretty solid start. Uh, Singapore is not one of my better tracks. It's. Uh, I'm not very good at it at all really, but I did a lot of practice on this one before I did the race, so I did get a little bit better at it. Going purple in the first sector. Trying to miss all the, uh, trying to hit the apexes but miss the curbs because the curbs tend to spin the uh, car a little bit. like that one there. We just got a, a little spin on the curb there. Went a little deep, but... And now we're a little down. And here we go go under the bridge here it's kind of a cool effect that they got the uh, like echo out of it so here we are coming up to the end of the lap uh, you didn't need to see that and we qualified for us which is uh, which is alright, but our, our rifle is finished third. Fernando is behind us, but uh, we tried it for a second run. And that's what happened. So, our second uh, attempt was uh, a no-go, so... But our team is happy with our fourth place in qualifying, so... That's good. So we'll go to the race strategy the tires starting on options and then they want us to come in for a set of options and then finish on primes but there is a 45 percent chance of rain for this race so i'm sure that'll be all out the window all right they're gonna steal the tv And here we go. Hamilton on the pole. There's us in fourth. Our teammate fifth. Our engineer doesn't have any encouraging words for us. 
And here we go with the start of the Singapore Grand Prix. We're getting an excellent start. And we're going to fly up. It's a, we're getting a strong start here. We just flew by him. Up in the first. We got a blistering start. We're going to go in and save some fuel right away. Went a, a little close to the, a little bit closer to the wall than I wanted to, but it's all right. There's many places where you miss the wall by, you know, just a few inches here and there. Just missing the wall there. <laughs> I almost missed the wall there. Where it, as you can see, we're just all over the walls here. And here we go. That w that's pretty much the end of the lap one. So we're going to move ahead here to lap 16. And we're lapping a car here. It says uh, our engineer is saying there's going to be rain in 15 minutes, but uh, our tires are kind of dead. But we're going to come in early now for our pit stop. We're going to put on another set of option tires and try to get in a bunch of good laps before the rain starts. We pulled out a pretty big gap, but and many cars are going to be coming in fairly soon for their pit stops also, but it looks like we're going to come out in sixth place. We touched the wall there a little bit. And then at the end of lap to 18. And you're saying rain in about 10 minutes now. So we've caught up with a, with a big load of cars. Here's Ricardo going a little slowly. There's a, just a big group here. We got Botas. And we're going to make a super dive here and go up the inside of three of them and get back up in the first. In lap 21. Our engineers are all saying heavy rain. And on lap 24. There's going to be heavy rain in a few minutes. And at the end of lap 25, it's uh, starting to rain. And our engineer wants us to change the intermediate tires at the line of lap 26, but he said heavy rain. So I made the decision to put on, I'm going to put on a set of wet tires and see if we can save ourselves a pit stop. We'll see if how this strategy works out for us. Seems like you're in this pit lane forever here. But we come out of it first. But we're sliding pretty badly here. And there goes Kuviat. He's unlapping himself. But now he's got the blue flag, so he's going to let us go by. But we're, we're struggling on the wet tires right now. And that's a lot Vettel to catch up and now go past us. 
we just don't have the grip. But at the end of lap 28, a bunch of cars are coming in now to put on wet tires. And now we're going to go back up in the first. And we're going to have a pretty decent sized gap. Not a whole lot happened, so we're moving ahead here. They said, aren't they saying the rain's going to improve in a few minutes here? Ten minutes. But in lap 52, going down the long straight here. But we're going a little long. And that's allowed Vettel to go by us. Our pace in the wet is not as good as the AIs, and Vettel just pulled away after that. And then um, at the end of lap 55 in the 56, a bunch of cars came in to change to intermediate tires, but our engineer didn't say anything. So we went by, and we were kind of struggling in this lap. We did go back up in the first, but we're definitely, we went, we had a pretty awful lap, so. We're coming in the change to intermediates. And there's us losing first. There's more cars going by on the mini map here. We're still in second. But now we're in third. We got jumped by uh, Rosberg. Who jumped us in the, uh, the pit stop there. And not a whole lot happened after that. We couldn't catch up with Rosberg. And in lap 60, we've reached the uh, two-hour time limit for the race. There was a dry line forming on the on the track. If the race was one more lap, I thought about putting on a set of uh, option tires and trying to catch up with with Rosberg, but that was not going to happen. We, we reached the time limit, so we're coming out to the line. I'm going to finish a solid third, which is pretty good for me since this is not one of my greater tracks. But as you can see, Vettel won the race. Our teammate was sixth. So our rifle took the lead again. And I was sandwiched in between Rosberg and Hamilton. Fourth place in the driver's championship. We're still fourth in the driver's standings. We've, we've gone past Ricardo, who uh, he didn't finish... He DNF'd in the uh, Singapore Grand Prix here. So we jumped ahead of him, but Vettel got in front of us, and so he's third now. And in the Constructors, we're still third. And we kind of evened out on the point situation with uh, Red Bull, since they got 25 and we got 23, so not a whole lot changed there. So that was the Singapore Grand Prix of my F1 2014 career mode. If you like this, give us a like and subscribe. And we'll see you guys again. Goodbye.